everyone, I'm Jonelle Kelly. Today we're going to take a look at a really new and exciting product from Pentard. This is opalescent crackle. Like our other crackles from Pentart, it's a two-step process and it's going to give us a sandblasted look on our finished product. Kind of exciting and definitely a different spin on crackle. For this project, I've chosen one of my favorite bottles. This is from 6th Street Distillery, a Texas brand. The brand is actually in Dimebox, Texas and called Dimebox Distillery. This bourbon is always found in these fabulous guitar shaped bottles. And I think once we get that sandblasted crackle on it, we're going to have some fun with it. The first thing we're going to do today is use our step one, paint it onto the bottle, and then we're going to let it dry thoroughly. The next step will be to come back and apply step two, merely painting it over without a lot of fussing with this, this case. We don't want to overwork step two. We just want to get it on there, leave it alone and let it dry. The third and final step is to decide if we like it as it is or if we want to use a Pentart wax to really help draw out the cracks. We'll experiment with that later. So let's get started. Check this out, our bottle dried completely clear. Now I've got to share with you, as I was painting that first coat on, it was drying really quick and became quite confusing because I'd actually find myself stopping and going, huh, I thought I painted that spot already. So there may be some areas that are a little thicker than they should be, but this is the first step completely dry. Okay, our bottle's dry, and now we're going to move on to step two, which is the second part of the two-part opalescent crackle. Here we go. Now, one of my biggest tips for working with crackle is you never want to overwork this second step. In other words, paint back and forth and, you know, all around in circles. Don't do that. The one thing we know about all crackles is we want to be very linear and just Fill the space and get that crackle on. Let's get it done. The cracks in this are amazing. This is the first time I've played with the opalescent crackle. And I gotta tell you, that is wow. Big, big random cracks, very different than fine lined. Yet, yet if you can look at it closely, you realize we've got this frosted glass look with big, deep cracks. That is awesome. Now, what are we going to do with our bottle? Let's talk about some ideas. This on its own is beautiful. And certainly towards the holidays, we all love just beautiful glass. You could put a candle in it, put a burlap bow, whatever your jam is, it's going to be fabulous just like this. But let's talk about ways that we're going to be able to step it up and bring it to the next level. In the directions that come with this, Pentart suggests using wax. So I've chosen the wax paste metallic in a beautiful blue. Let's see what happens as we begin to add some of it to our bottle. I'm going to start up here and see if it pops out the logo. Oh, 
I'm going to get my wax on there and then I'm going to use my rag and wipe it up a bit so that I have a real consistent smooth look on that wax. My goal is to tint it, not change it because I really like this finish with the opalescent. Now that looks really good and I'm kind of excited. So maybe we'll just tint our bottle a slight waxy color blue. Ready? Let's do this. Now I'm going to be me and I'm dipping my finger in there because that's what I enjoy as an artist. Can't, oh, look at that. Okay. I'm starting to see the magic here. How about you? Let's wipe it back and see what we've got. All right, now here's what I'm thinking. That wax really drops in to those cracks. That's the magic of Pentart Crackle, but it also does preserve that sandblasted look in the background. And this is fun. <laughs> okay, everyone. Here's my initial thoughts. I was a little bit nervous about opalescent crackle and sandblasted looks, but uh, I've got to tell you, I am absolutely in love with this. The wax really creates this uh, almost mercury glass look with the uh, sandblasted look to the background and those beautiful random cracks. And I'm going to tell you, this product is fantastic. And I'm really, really excited about the possibilities and the fun we're all going to have playing with the Pentart Crackle Effect. So back at it, this is the Opalescent Crackle Steps 1 and 2. Remember, we put the 1 on, let it dry, then put our 2 on the dry surface and let that dry. It will turn clear when it's finished. My final step was adding the Pentart Wax. There's dozens of colors in this fabulous wax, and it's going to give you this beautiful, beautiful finish. So everybody, I'm Jonelle Kelly. Have fun with this spectacular new product from Pentar.